subscribe or you'll be visited by the toll troll. Is it comfy? I'm a white work from home neat, what would I be in for? I kinda want some land to garden and get into the city, mountains, and beaches easily. Why would you move to one of the worst crime infested locations on earth? Just go to Detroit if you want your daughter raped by a jogger. Don't you see how Bukele has been putting the country in prison and they still have more gangs to jail? They never run out. You're regarded and don't know what you're talking about. You have no idea what's happened in El Salvador in the last five years do you? To get a fast-tracked visa you need to be bringing business value or be able to buy the visa outright. Borders exist to prevent hopeless needs like you from squatting in countries that they don't belong to. Why El Salvador though, why not just move to remote America, Alaska, Montana, someplace with a low population? Let me repeat it for you. For the past five years they put 20% of their criminals in jail. And they still got another 80% to go. But you keep reading memes and take your family there by all means. Learn Spanish. You can say, mi casa es su casa. Mi esposa es su esposa. Mi hija es su esclava. You are a free man. I would avoid that poop hole. The shill wants you to go to a Bitcoin accepted country so they can do social experiments on you much easier. The moment you step foot on that land you are some glowy's play thing. They let you have some corns and want to see what you do with it in a more controllable environment than normal. I don't see how I'm glowing. I'm getting tired of the US and want to quit paying the insane income and property taxes we have to a government that just wastes it on Ukraine and Israel. Hey FBI IDF vaccinated loser. El Salvador said no to the cabal and is rounding up the tiny hat funded MS-13 criminals. Safe now and won't put up with BS. El Salvador likes Bitcoin and wants to grow, way safer than France, Germany and Sweden at this point. It's a matter of a year before Bukele gets pushed out by a new commie revolution and the country becomes a crap hole again didn't say you were glowing. Only that when you try to live in these progressive crypto countries you are being watched carefully by people you have no idea of. If that's something that doesn't bother you then you're totally fine. I would not decide to do that though. It's too expensive. They use the dollar, so you get no benefit. There are much more affordable countries to immigrate to. The people will see how good life is without tiny hat communism, the based people there will not tolerate this and will round up these criminals. All they have to do is pull down the men's pants and quickly they can see who is evil or not, hint, those with mutilated genitalia are evil. People go to Panama and Colombia, not El Salvador. How would you be work from home and a neat? If you're the kind of cringe lord who would pay $1,000 to hear Michael Saylor and Max Kaiser's prosperity gospel at Bitcoin Miami then you're more than two-thirds of the way there already. El Salvador still isn't where it needs to be to draw people in other places like Dubai or Puerto Rico. Why would you move to one of the worst crime-infested locations on earth? This isn't a threat about moving to the US read more carefully. How does being butchered with a rusty knife sound? Even moving to Mexico is risky as heck for white Americans. El Salvador is much more dangerous. Since I know Panama is probably too expensive for you I would suggest Costa Rica. It may not be the cheapest but you'll prob get to keep all your organs. I've done a good amount of research on this. The danger of Mexico really depends on the location you buy which makes it pretty much like most places on earth but Mexico doesn't offer a lot of incentive to move there. Mexico isn't really getting better as quickly as it could slash should, so much as the US is getting worse, which is making Mexico's slow development appear relatively better than it is. They have big dreams that should be able to be made into realities but they can't execute very well. Panama and Costa Rica definitely beat out Mexico without question but they're a little more expensive as you noted. Best places I've found so far is Puerto Rico and UAE slash Dubai unless you can spring for Monaco or the platinum tier places like it. 